the scenes of destruction from the air. This is all that is left after torrential rains pounded the interior of the northeast states of Pernambuco and Alagoas the past few days. Dozens of people have been killed, but the death toll doesn't capture the true destruction caused when the rivers flooded their banks. Rescue officials say there is worry of a rising death toll. They say as many as hundreds are still unaccounted for, mostly from small rural towns in the middle of the two affected states. Those who have survived the floods and mudslides have lost their homes and are now on the move carrying all they have on their backs. Others are taking shelter in local schools. A state of emergency has been declared. Doctors flown in to help tend to the sick say there is now worry of waterborne disease spreading. In Pernambuco state, 30 cities are in a state of emergency. And there are reports of entire cities with no public services. And in Alagoas state, officials say more than 10,000 houses have been destroyed. An untold number of bridges washed away, complicating aid efforts. Rescue officials in the hardest hit areas say the scene reminds them of the effects of a tsunami. Most of the rescue operations have been complete, officials tell Al Jazeera, and now it's a rush to get aid to victims in need. The military has been called in to help, and there might be more to come, as the forecast calls for more rains in the coming days. Gabriel Elizondo, Al Jazeera, Rio de Janeiro.